Hello and welcome to Elementary STEM with Miss Crosman. Today we are going to be listening to a story called Muncha, Muncha, Muncha. And in this story, the farmer has a little bit of a problem with his garden. And your job is going to be to identify what that problem is and then build a solution to help him with his problem because he went through a lot of possible solutions and I'm not sure any of them were very successful. So you're gonna figure out what the problem is identify what you think you need to do to solve that problem and then use some building materials in order to build a solution and oftentimes in class we use legos to build a solution for this particular problem but you may have some different materials around i found these i thought these would make an interesting material to use to create a solution i even grabbed a box of dominoes and said, you know, I could even figure out a solution using just dominoes. So go ahead and listen to the story and figure out how you would solve the farmer's problem. Muncha, Muncha, Muncha by Candace Fleming and G. Brian Karras. For years, Mr. McGreeley dreamed of planting a garden. He dreamed of getting his hands dirty, of growing yummy vegetables, and of gobbling them all up. This spring, said Mr. McGreeley, this spring, by golly, I'm going to plant a garden. So he hoed and he sowed and he watched his garden grow. Lettuce, carrots, peas, tomatoes, yum, yum, yummy, said Mr. McGreeley. I'll soon fill my tummy with crisp, fresh veggies. But one night when the sun went down and the moon came up, three hungry bunnies appeared. Tippy, 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 pat, muncha, muncha, muncha. The next morning, when Mr. McGreeley saw his gnawed sprouts, he was angry. So he built a small wire fence all around his vegetable garden. There, he declared, no bunny can get into my garden now. And the sun went down and the moon came up and tippy, 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 pat, spring hurdle, dash, 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 muncha, muncha, muncha. The next morning, when Mr. McGreeley saw his nibbled leaves and gnawed sprouts, he was really angry. So he built a tall wooden wall behind the small wire fence all around his vegetable garden. Humph, he humped. Those flop ears will never get over it. No bunny can get into my garden now. And the sun went down and the moon came up and tippy, 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 pat, dig, scrabble, scratch, 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 spring, hurdle, dash, 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 muncha, muncha, muncha. The next morning when Mr. McGreeley saw his chewed stems, his nibbled leaves, and his gnawed sprouts, he was really, really angry. So he made a deep wet trench outside the tall wooden wall behind the small wire fence all around his vegetable garden. Ha, he snorted, those puff tails can't get under it. They can't get over it. No bunny can get into my garden now. And the sun went down and the moon came up and tippy, 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 pat, dive, paddle, splash, 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 dig, scrabble, scratch, 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 spring, hurdle, dash, 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 muncha, muncha, muncha. The next morning, when Mr. McGreeley saw his chomped blossoms, his chewed stems, his nibbled leaves, his gnawed sprouts, he was furious. So he hammered and blocked, sawed and stalked, drilled and filled and trapped and locked. And he built a huge, enormous thing before the deep wet trench outside the tall wooden wall behind the small wire fence all around his vegetable garden. I've outsmarted those twitch whiskers for sure, he exclaimed. They can't get through it, they can't get under it, and they can't get over it. No bunny, no way, no how can get into my vegetable garden now. And the sun went down and the moon came up and tippy, 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 stop. The three hungry bunnies looked and smelled and touched the huge, enormous thing before them and tippy, 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 pat. The bunnies hopped away. The next morning when Mr. McGreeley saw his untouched vegetables, he was happy. I beat the bunnies. He whooped and did a jiggly wiggly victory dance. Then he climbed over, jumped across, squeezed between, and crawled under until he reached his vegetable garden. Ah, sighed Mr. McGreeley, at last. Smacking his lips, he picked and pulled up lettuce, carrots, peas, tomatoes, and with his basket overflowing, he reached inside for something yummy. 
Muncha, muncha, muncha.